and as you can see, I did $13,600 in the last seven days. But it was not always like that. After more than one year of not quite succeeding with dropshipping, I finally found my first winning product. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how I did it. And I'm going to show you the overall strategy that got me to these numbers. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. So step number one, I had to find the actual product. For this, I tried the classical way. So I created a brand new TikTok account and I started engaging with dropshipping content, meaning that I interacted with every possible ad of a dropshipping product that I saw. After a few hours of doing this, TikTok will understand that you're a degenerate and you only want to see ads. So it will actually listen to you and it will only show you ads. By seeing all of these ads, I was able to make a very long list of all of the products that had potential. In this list, I have included information such as how many views do the ads have and how many competitors could I find selling the same product. After doing a bit of research, I finally found the product that I wanted to start testing. Now, the next logical thing for me to do was to just order the product to my house and start filming ads. As you already know by now, this is a very saturated product, so I didn't want to just copy other people. I wanted to make my own ads because I felt like that was the only way I could stand out. The problem was that on Amazon, this product was priced outrageously oh high. God, bro. Oh, hell no, man. So I needed to find a better supplier for my product. And that's when I decided to start using AutoDS, this amazing platform that's basically all in one. It helps us with everything, but more specifically with automation. After doing some research on AutoDS, I was finally able to find the product. And as you can see right here, I can import the product from AutoDS to my store with the help of only a few clicks. And I could resume my original plan of ordering the product for myself. Now, after receiving the product, I did a lot of work and I put in a lot of effort to film these ads. In total, I filmed around 45 ads, but unfortunately, all of them flopped. So in total, after all of this process took me like one month, I made zero dollars in sales. But I saw that my competitors were still doing very well. And a lot of the people I knew that were selling the same exact product were doing thousands of dollars a day. So what am I missing? That was the moment when I realized I needed a mindset change. I don't know about any other fields, but I know for sure that in dropshipping, if you have a mentor, that's going to help you move a bit faster. So naturally, I decided to contact my mentor and tell him about the situation that I was in. This is what he told me. Hey man, so I started selling this this back product, this posture corrector, and it's, it seems that it's not working quite well for me. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I, I showed you the, the TikTok post that I did. Can, can you guide me? Hey, Serban. So this is a very saturated product. You know, a lot of stores are selling it. The problem that you have here is that you're doing organic posts on TikTok and that it's not going to work. You know, the strategy works for products that are new in the market, not on what you want to sell. So if you want to have success with this product, I advise you to start running some TikTok ads. And so I did. After making a lot of combinations between the videos that I shot myself with the product and the ones that I could find on the internet, I came up with some final versions of the ads that I wanted to run. Guys, I hit it big. Look at this. This was the first day that I tested this product in the 24th of December, 2023. I had close to 200 sessions and actually did $334 with a conversion rate of 3.5%. This is the moment when I realized that my mentor was right because this is the type of product that you would definitely want to run ads on. The reason for that is just as he said, it is a very saturated product and you don't want to compete with the people that are already doing this for years. After this first day, I did a bit of tweaking on my ads. I changed the hook and I changed the offer. And also I did some changes on the product page, including more gifts and customer testimonials. Guess what? It actually paid off because the next day in the 25th of December, I actually did $5 shy of $1,000, $995 in my second day of testing. This gave me a lot of confidence in the product. So I started recording some ads again by myself. I posted all of those videos on my TikTok account, but then again, all of them flop. It seemed like this was just an idea that I was hanging on to, but it just didn't work for me. So I said to myself, that's it. No more organic, no more filming ads by myself. I'm going to focus all of my energy on my ads. And this is why the next day I managed to make 
This was a very good day for me. It was 10 times more than I had in the first day, so I wanted to know what to do next. So I called up my mentor, hoping that he will not steal my product, and I asked for his advice. This is what he told me. Hey man, so thanks for the advice. Uh, I took your advice on, on run, started running some ads and it, it went out pretty well. I sent you some screenshots and as you can see, uh, I, I did some numbers in there. It's not a lot, but I think this product is, is pretty much working. So I don't know what to do now because I don't have a lot of money to, to scale and I, I want to know what should I do next. Hey, Serban. First of all, you know, congratulations. Uh, it seems like your sales started to take off. If I were in your position right now, you know, I would pump those budgets up as much as I can and closely monitor the ad spend. You got this, you know, let me know how it goes. This was a bit uncomfortable for me because I knew that if I wanted to reach my goals, I needed to put in more money in ads, but I knew that I was definitely not going to stay in the same place forever. Guys, I'm very glad that I listened to his advice because as you can see right here in the 27th of December, I did more than $5,000 in sales. And if we go to the next day, which is the 28th of September, 7.2K. The 29th of December got me close to $8,000 in sales. In the 30th of December, I passed $8,000. And in the last day of 2023, I managed to make more than $10,000 in one single day with one single product on one single platform. So guys, as you can see right here, I managed to make more than $44,000 in less than one week of running ads. Don't get me wrong, this was not easy, especially given the fact that this is such a saturated product. One of the key takeaway here would be to not run from oversaturated products. Yes, if a product is saturated, that means that a lot of other stores are selling it. But that doesn't mean that we don't have any more room left in there to start selling the product ourselves. It just means that you have to be more careful with the way you're selling the product. Also, besides that, it's very good to have someone beside you, someone who has already got to where you want to go. My mentor in this example gave me a huge piece of advice and he gave me the encouragement that I needed to move forward. And definitely more than anything, you need a tool such as AutoDS for automation and fulfillment. So that's it guys, it was definitely not an easy process, but it was worth it and I learned a lot. And just to give you some numbers for the ending, as you can see right here, we did more than $70,000 and the profit margins were 31% which means that the net profit was around $22,000. Maybe for some of you that's not a lot of money, but for me that is the sign of a very successful beginning to 2024. I promise you that I'm going to document my journey every step of the way, so make sure to subscribe. Thank you for watching, until next time.